WMUR News 9 starts now. Good evening, I'm Sharice LeClaire with this WMUR News 9 update. We now know the name of a driver killed in a crash on Interstate 89 in Enfield. Police have identified him as 83-year-old Robert Fuhrer of Peacham, Vermont. They say he was driving north in the high-speed lane when he veered off into the median and hit a guardrail. Fuhrer was pronounced dead at the scene. There's no word yet on a cause. The cause of a fire at an abandoned mill building in Barnstead is under investigation tonight. It happened just after 6 this morning on Depot Street. Crews say that building is now a total loss. No one was hurt. Recycled Percussion held the grand opening of its Chaos and Kindness store in Laconia today. Large crowds of fans showed up to be the first ones inside to get their hands on t-shirts, sweatshirts and other band merchandise. What we wanted to do is do something really cool in this community of Laconia and start to build the Chaos and Kindness brand globally. Really cool thing to be a part of, to be here for the opening of all this chaos. The store will be open five days a week. It'll be closed on Mondays and Tuesdays. See a new episode of Chaos and Kindness tonight at 1130 right here on WMUR. And now here's meteorologist Eric Weglars with the forecast. Looks pretty good going into the start of next week even as well. The heat and humidity are expected to increase and then a few showers and storms roll through as we go through the afternoon hours on Monday. In fact, you can see the line here starting to take shape in the Great Lakes Point south through St. Louis. That moisture will be what ends up touching off our showers and storms later on Monday. Tonight though looks great. We get some fog first thing in the morning. We'll fall back into the middle and upper 50s. Very similar to last night and a little bit cooler towards the north as well where we will find some 40s and even some lower 40s for that matter as well by first thing tomorrow morning. Here is the seven day forecast. A lot of sunshine through tomorrow and again on Monday and then the showers and storms do arrive late in the day. Nothing severe, but you will find a few rumbles of thunder, especially west and north and then a cool down for the middle of next week. We fall back to the low 70s. Still some question marks as to how warm we get for the end of next week, but right now it looks like it stays sunny and temperatures will at least hit the middle 70s, if not close to 80, Cherise. All right, Eric, looks like a gorgeous week. Thanks so much. You can join us for all the night's news at 10 on MeTV New Hampshire and after the game right here on WMUR.